Evan and Jess, Deer Creek Public Schools has been back in session for about three weeks, and parents who reached out to me say that they are wanting to go back to that traditional scheduling because the AB model of virtual and in-person learning simply isn't working. It doesn't help the kids learn, and it can be frustrating to the children, which deters their academic gains. Sydney Kinsey has two children who attend Deer Creek Public Schools. She says the first few weeks of online learning has been frustrating on their entire family. It just is a struggle trying to get them focused on what are we learning, what are we doing, how did your teacher teach you this? Mindy Mackey is a mother of three school-age boys, also feeling the daily struggles. When parents work all day and have to come home and and um, begin teaching children things that we haven't had since we were in grade school. Um, it's very stressful. Both moms signing this petition for Deer Creek Public Schools to go back to a traditional five day school week. We need to look at the overall picture, analyze the amount of COVID cases within our own school district and make um, educated decisions on what's best for our families. Now, Deer Creek is following their return to learn plan. They sent us this set statement saying that they voted on that July 30th, which follows the OSDHN, the Oklahoma State Department of Education state map and guidelines. Deer Creek is reconvening to the return to learn committee this evening, the earliest possible day to meet together after the state COVID alert system showed that Oklahoma County to be in yellow. A recommendation as to when and how Deer Creek schools will transition students to and from remote and traditional learning will be shared and the Deer Creek Board of Education will have that information for the staff and the families tonight. Now we're told that Deer Creek covers about five school districts and uh, excuse me, five zip codes and three counties. So they have a lot of information that they look at when they make it these types of decisions. We'll definitely be following this for you. We'll be following that meeting tonight and following any meetings after that. We'll keep you informed. We're live at Deer Creek tonight in the public school district. Katrina Adger, KOCO 5 News.